Right. Uh, we were discussing about the universal gates. Under that, we discuss about the universal NOR gate and a universal NAND gate. So here, a uh, small quick refreshment of what we have discussed last day. Uh, actually, if you combine this, you can create NOT gate here also the same. Then by using them, you can create the other gates here. You can see and gate using NAND gate. Basically what we have done here, we have taken a NAND and converted that again to NOT. NAND is noted. Once NAND is converted to NOT gate, then you can get uh, this AND gate back. Here, by using the De Morgan's law, you can see uh, this one is basically converted this using the De Morgan's law, right? That is the second. And then, um, similar to that, NOGATE can also be used. And here, uh, O gate using NOGATE, and here, uh, and gate using no gate, just using the De Morgan's law. Right. These kind of questions are common in the examination. They might ask different questions, different time. So they will ask you to convert or create. They will ask you to create this uh, a given circuit using NAND only or no only representation. NAND only representation or no only representation. They will ask that. Right, we have done that as well. And we saw how if one, if in a one line, if there are two NAND gates, uh, so two NOT gates, sorry, two NOT implementation, you can cut down that here, so you, can, you can see two NOTs in one path and you can cut down and create only one. So that is basically how we can reduce the number of NANDs that we have used. And this example shows how really an IC is configured. This has only NAND, NAND only IC. This is IC 7400, a very primary IC 7400. And when you provide input AB, so here A not B is there. And A, uh, he, here this one is a, uh, can you remember this is half adder. How can we create a half adder using uh, this 7400 IC? And this example shows that. I have taken two ICs to create a half adder. How? So let's see the wires. A not B, A not B, A and B is there. Then I have used A not is basically by feeding A to both. Right? You can see A not. That is the implementation because A you can feed it to both this one and this one, and then A not is. Receive then B you can feed it separately. So likewise you can create a full adder using uh, half adder using this uh, IC seven four double zero. That is the half adder implementation using this, right? Okay. So if you want, we can uh, try this along at home. Uh, right. This is the seven four double zero IC a bare one. And uh, so let's try something else using the, the 7400 IC. Let's try, try something else. And then you can uh, like just, okay. Uh, you, need, uh, you need to implement this one. Um, see, you need to implement. Um, try, let's try to implement uh, A uh, and B not. A and B not using this. I see. Can you try this alone as an exercise? A and B not using this IC. Just try it now. Right. Okay. Uh, A. Mama Q, this one, right? A and B not. A and B. B is not basically B not. Not A. Okay. A and B not. Here, actually, B is the one which is not, right? Only B not. Sir, I... You have not at A, ne? Wa A was the one not color A. Sir, I have got a not here. Me, land again, I have got a... Me, take a... I have got I... Me, not take a I, you know? Ah, I have got a B, not take 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 a B, not
I thought that uh, you put the B not first and then use the N key. That was I. What are the extra? Okay, you have solved and uh, done this. The solve color the kare. I have an atuka rotten. Okay, let's let's do here. B not me. Then you can feed B here. B. So when you put B there, you will get B not from here, right? Agree. Method in B not main. Okay. Yes, sir. Okay, then I'm sending that and you can amatra mang A yaw no. Then A B not. But here it will be ended. Make an N menama. But this N will be noted again. That means A and B not. A and B not. That will be noted again. You are highlighting this point, right? That will be noted again. So I need to note this again to get. I need to note this again to get the result. Yeah. Hmm. Therefore, I can connect this one uh, with this one as well as this one both. To not it again, right? Then here you will get the result. So this is the final result. How did you do? Right, that is that is what uh, actually B I have converted to B not. Then A I have taken. Then send it to send it through this. Then again I noted that and I got the final result. So what did you do? You have uh, you send A B both. You send A B both using this, but no, you have taken A not. Mm -hmm. A not and B. You have taken A uh, A not and B. A one are not Kalati anymore. After that, you have ended with B. Actually, this will be ended. A not and B, and that's it. That is basically the reverse. This one. This is equal to A not not. But the symbol will change neither. O B not. So A B not and low again, we not say that. A B not and on it. A or B not turn on it. Okay, okay. Mm. That's the thing. Understood? Yes, sir. Uh, this can be, you, you can do this with uh, something like this. Make O or no? If you have O this, then that will be converted to N. Uh, if I could uh, use no gate. No gate, no, uh, no gate example, yeah. If you use no gate example, it can be done. So be careful with that, right? Okay. Yes. Okay, so let's uh, move to the next one. Okay, next is about the, the now we have discussed about combinational logic gates and we have to finish uh, the logic gate lesson today that is by discussing the sequential logic gate part. Okay, sequential logic gate is like unlike the other one. The sequential uh, logic gate is basically focusing on um, sequential logic gate is focusing on uh, basically uh, memory. How memorizing happens is basically uh, done using the sequential logics. Why? 
because these are called feedback circuits. This see this simple feedback circuit. So when zero is sent to this NOT gate, one will be received. And when one is captured using this NOT gate, zero will be. Then if you send that zero back to the this one and that one back here, zero. The zero will be one, one will be so this will be rotated. This will be rotated as you are taking the output again as the input. So it's the feedback. So it will be rotated, but not forever because of the resistance and all. This will be there for some time. And after that, you will not be able. So when you charge this, so this will be rotated for few, maybe minutes or few hours even. So and after that, the voltage will be will not be there. Okay. Because of the resistance. Because if it is not resistance, if there are no resistance, then it will, this will go forever. But that is not the thing. Anyway, uh, the energy will be converted to some other energies. Okay, so shall we write down this quickly? Sequential logic circuits, this one, as well as the uh, simple uh, feedback circuit. Actually, this is used to create random access memory, static and so basically static random access because dynamic random access memory, this method is costly. For dynamic access, random access memory is leaky capacitors I use, not this. Because this method is a bit expensive and fast. These fast memories are used in static random access memories. So where are these SRAMs are there? Where can you see the SRAMs, static random access memories? Yes. Where have you seen these SRAMs, static random access memories or SRAMs? Hello? Uh, actually, not sure about it. <laughs> Cache memories and registers inside the processor. Right? Inside the processor. Cache memory inside the processor. The registers inside the processor are created using this strand, strand, uh, static random access memories. But normally, whatever we are using as a RAM, dynamic random access memory, it is not this. RAM mega with the way, but the RAM which is inside the processor is static RAM. That is cache memory and registers. You can write down within bracket cache memory and registers. Cache. Okay, there are, those are static random access memories. Please write down this. Right. So let's uh, move forward and uh, let's understand how these. Feedback circuits can be used to create memories. This is a bit complex, but only thing is uh, you need to understand that after that it will be more uh, like it, it will be easy. But only thing is they understand the timing and all these things that is really important. Okay, so let's create a circuit like this and uh, we can do this using our logic.ly platform also. And so then we can understand how this is, this really happens, right? We are using, okay, here the latch is that. Latch, the example, the latch is basically that part. Okay, so but let latch to be there and let me create the flip-flop, the, the other one, uh, not the flip-flop, the other one. So let's construct this first and see, then you will understand. Actually, when you constructed and added this uh, clock signal, clock signal is for the synchronization purpose, we can create that. But without the clock signal, let's see how it works and let's add the clock signal after that and see the practical implementation of that. But before that, let's add this. Mm -mm. Okay, uh, sorry. No gate. Another no gate. Two inputs. Only connect one to the switch. So the second input, you need to take it from the output of this one. A bit odd. The output of this one need to be taken here. And in order to sense this, I'm using two bulbs, right? Because then we can sense what is going there. That's why I'm using two bulbs. Okay, this is the simplest implementation of this circuit. 
both are zero at the initial stage. Let me initialize, okay? okay now it is initialized and let's see how it works. So if I try, if I try to put this, press this, press this again, nothing happens, no. Nothing, nothing goes, nothing uh, will change. Now you can see this bulb is turned on, this bulb is turned off and let me analyze this. Okay, let me analyze this. Uh, zero here. This zero should come here. Ne? May zero again with the nom, may zero may wire a digi with the name. Hurry, the rake, I mean, not zero. Methana switch again is zero. Hurry. Whether a zero, zero. If zero, zero making good, okay, taking any zero. Have a method of bind not take a kill on me, not take a kill on the one. Zero, zero through O gate is zero, but it will be noted, therefore it's one. This one will light up the bulb. So here it's one, right? Make it one. And this one will go here also. This is zero, and the, this is zero. Zero, one, O gate taking one, have a not in the zero. Then make a one karat If I make this one, 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 to the O gate one and because of the not it is zero. So it doesn't matter whether I change this or not. If I change this or not change, change, not change, that doesn't affect our output. Output is one and that not, that is not affecting this one. So if I want to turn off the bulb, if I want to turn off this bulb, what I need to do is only I can do something with, because these are the inputs. I can do something with this one only, making it a more So let's try this one. If I try this one, can you see it's off? Why? Because then one, this is one, this will become one. Mea at one na. The one zero gyo to get taking one. O get taking one gyo take it not caring a zero karna. Bulb back off and off. The bulb will turn off. The bulb will turn off. But if I try to, okay, bulb will turn off, that zero will go here. Zero, zero is here. Zero, zero is here. That zero will send zero here, but that will be inverted to one. Now one here, metana one tama. I'm considering this, I'm considering only this. Right, I don't want to consider both. I'm considering only this bulb, right? This is my major concern. This bulb can be turned off using this. But after turning off, if I try to do something, nothing happens. So that is the nature. Mom make a try karat, try karat, done again. Off karabu bulb beka. Aapa hu off karana beh. Make a reset ke la pigi. Now this is called reset. That means make a on me la di bot off karana bulu. Have a off karat pa se aay mona karat make off any net. Nothing to do. Off karabu bulb beka. Off karana tere venam switch chakati. If I turn off, if I try to give one, zero, one, zero, nothing happens. This is reset. And this is set. This is set. Therefore, this is called SR latch. SR latch. Set, reset. SR latch. Set. Again, if it is zero, if zero is there, this can, don't consider the other one. Then Only consider about this bulb. Right? Consider this bulb as a memory. Right? So now, what is memorizing zero? So if I try to do reset again, reset, we cannot reset again, reset again, not possible, but you can set it. After setting, this is one. Now, if I try to, nothing will happen. I can reset. Right, I can set, reset both. <laughs> that is a problem. Right, whatever that is, that, that will depend. But that will depend. That is basically here. If I try to do this, basically it's not affecting that output, but that is undefined because may reset set karana. So that will not work, but reset set karana. So set karana But if I put that and try to reset also, there's a problem right here. It's not properly resetting. So that is not a status that we should discuss. That is undefined, not defined status. Okay, let's go to the note and see then. If this is set, this is the set. 
if this is if q is zero if q is zero state can set the q right if q is zero only right if q is zero q is this one set can set that q if q is one set and reset change in set or reset to zero will do nothing if q is one press in reset will reset the q reset the q to one zero in such case, if you try to set it again, it will set. But, right? Yeah. When Q is zero, it can set. When it Q is zero, press in one can set it. One, when Q is one, set in reset can reset it. But press in set and reset both same time will do nothing. And that is undefined state that cannot be defined. But when you try to, when you try to, uh, try to not to press, try not to press set and reset, that means nothing, no, no input, no. You don't want to consider set, preset, dekama bindu and anything. It will maintain the current state. But if Q is one, present set will do nothing. If Q is zero, present set will do setting if q is one setting reset will do resetting but if q is zero setting reset will do nothing right those are the status i think you need to draw this and show because that is very important fact that you need to consider here this is your first latch that is sr latch this can be converted to flip flop by adding a clock i'll show that as well first of all please write and draw this I will give you the English medium note. Wait, wait. Ah, here it is there. So first of all, please draw this. I'll give you the English medium note after that. S for set and R for reset, right? So this is, uh, I need to put that same uh, word in. So set, reset, uh, here. Reset. Right. So this one is basically this gate combination. You can create use NAND gate also. Uh, this you know this is no one NAND again. You, know, you can use NAND gate too for creating this. Uh, this you know, so this is NAND gate. Let's use NAND gate and uh, but uh, the thing is the behavior will be uh, slightly different from the previous one because the gate that you are using is NAND gate. Here, let me connect this and this, and then uh, input with the output. And also, the, to test, I'm using two bulbs. Actually, these bulbs are given opposite, uh, opposite uh, thing, but here, at the initial level, you can see here. Um, I'm trying to change this. You can see. So what's happening there? And I'm trying to change this. This is bit uh, the different behavior than the previous one. Okay. So if I try to reset, think about this bar. Try to reset that. Nothing happens. But uh, try to reset that. This one will do the resetting part. Right. Try to set that. No feedback and so if you are using NAND, so the latch will be different. The behavior of the latch is different. So basically, better if you can know learn this using no. But NAND latch is also there. Yeah, this is NAND latch. The NAND latch is also there. You can see and uh, the better right when you go no latch NAND latch both are here. This is the NAND latch. Right here SNR in and latch so how it happened q q not snr set reset q and q not the q is here in the top but if it is no latch set side is this reset side is this the q is opposite side of the 
set set tf is here then the q is here three set here q not is here but this one set side the q is there three set side it's the opposite side so please know the difference right this is sr this is sr uh, and so this one is not uh, included uh, so let me include this one too because this one was not included there and uh, this nan latch is also needed so let's have the truth table also is needed this part it's a better explanation not not this not this not this even this will uh, this will show both right because nan latch was not there i hope that you can so this is uh, you can see s not r not is used as the uh, inputs here s and r as you said s side uh, q is in the other side right s side uh, so place to place the differences are there that is the thing anyway you can see this s not r not and that is used here you have to use not part and then the stand like let's use not gates and see add not gates and see uh, how the behavior changes now i'm going to add s not r not s not r not let me add now two not gates to invert that Because you can experiment all these things. No need to rely on the nodes, everything like what is in the net. internet. You can just. Now you can see the behavior is big normalized. Now we can do something. And uh, one set, you cannot do anything here. This is set. One set, it is set. Like one set, it is set. But if you want to reset, you have to use this. Right. Once reset, you can set using this. Once reset, you can set using this setting one. Zero there. Reset. Reset will reset this queue. And reset will reset this queue. And if I if you want to set it again off this and set it. But if you try to off both, nothing will happen. If you try to on both, that is undefined state. Do not rely on this state because this is undefined state. Now this is set. You can reset from this. Right? Now you are setting, setting this using this. But you have to use S0 and R0. Remember that. So let me draw this. This is S0. Set0. This is reset0. This is NAND only. This was not there in the book. That is why I'm telling you. Set0, reset0. And this is the main goal of setting, right? But this one, this is reset. This is set. And this is the main goal. Oh, oh, oh other way. Sorry. This is reset. This is set. Oh, let's consider the bottom one. This is reset. This is set. And then the queue is opposite side of that. This is the queue that we intend to set. Okay, now let's experiment, right? Now let's experiment because everything you can test. Don't just read the notes. Experiment. Ex experiment. Okay. When so think only about the queue, only about the queue. Let's try to understand this. Only about the queue. If queue is not set, then a queue not set will have. This is the queue, right? This is the queue. If queue is not set, set can set this. But after that, if you try to set it, set it, set it again, nothing will happen. Okay, turn off. When queue is set, reset can reset down that. After that, if you try to reset, 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 nothing will happen. Understood? Therunad? If not, tell me. Hello? Yes, sir. Okay, here. Make it. This is the queue, right? If you make a queue, that is a queue. That means it. That queue, pahal hai, na bolu, queue pal hai, but it's not the pal hai. Har the na, dinne kora hariya dinne, na. Right? Okay. Now trying. Right. Now, 
let's try s not consider about the k uh, set now this is set only reset can reset that after that trying to reset 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 nothing will happen but now this is reset so try to set we'll do the task after that set 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 nothing will happen right actually this is s right this is s so this s the whole thing you have to consider as a s not right may they get ekata ganna s not take with you actually you are saying this is, this is not your s not make a andi make s not name you are s kiyala ma ganna pulu why this is s this is s and this is r why this is s and r because this s here is noted here this r is noted here that r not s not kill hitan no na but if you only draw in this uh, nand only if you are not draw in this one and this one me deka andinne nattam ehema nan s not r not kill di if you are not draw in this not and this not just write s not here r not here again me diagram ekak hari api dakke this diagram is correct this is sending s not r not mokada not deka andala ne here metana nan andala thiyena me chuti bindu dekak kiyala this is sending s not r not that is correct ave metana podi avulak thiyena s patte q thiyena r patte eka wara thi s patte q neme thiyenne me balan api haduwam s patte thiyenne q not s walde ata patte thama q thiye r patte thiyenne q ekai man ke eke podi avulak thiyena api right the other thing is okay they make hari make s patte q r patte finish okay now you can write this not so set and reset s can set change to uh, actually q to from 1 to 0 and uh, set can sorry set can change q 1 if it is 0 and r can change q to 0 if it is 1 set and reset then these are used in cache memories and uh registers as i said and physical memory or the dynamic random access memory is not using this technology it is using something called leaky capacitors right so it's not 
but SRAM, static RAMs are using latches or flip flop. What is a latch? What is the flip flop? So there's a difference. Here you can see this one that we have created, mainly it's known as latch, right? But when you put a clock signal, when you put two AND gate and a clock signal to synchronize this, you can see only here, only when the clock signal, this changes, but mom may click around, this will change only when the clock signal is available. There's a timing, not always. If I if I'm hurrying to change that, no. I have to wait until the clock signal. Because when clock signal passes only, the values passes to the AND gate. When clock take a one, the AND gate take a one one pay. If the clock take a one in a quarter, the then value we can make pass when. The mom makes zero when I love my kick or another on a zero moments can wait. Are the clock at a zero will I mama? I can clock at a zero. No, make a better clock at a one will I make effect. So that is what the flip flop is. It's using a clock to synchronize. Clock signal is on no signal. Okay, you can write down this part very quickly. Then I'll show the other, I'll compare the other set. Right. So here, uh, so I have like explained what is the clock signal. Basically, clock signal is on off signal uh, frequently. It's a uh, it's maintaining a kind of on off signal flow with the same timing. So you know it's like uh, the clock that you are using. Uh, so we have seconds, and then uh, minutes. Likewise, this clock is basically maintain in a single frequency right therefore when uh, the clock signal is one only the other signal will be passed then clock signal is zero other signal will not be passed it is to control okay there are different kind of uh, flip-flop circuits that we have in this memory so that you first that uh, we have learned about this sr flip-flop and you can see the behavior it has this set and reset set and reset behavior we just discussed. And there's another one called JK flip-flop. Uh, JK flip-flop is uh, not, uh, this, this is actually a modification of SR uh, flip-flop. And uh, the only issue is here uh, in the SR flip-flop, you have undefined state when both are pressed. But here, when both are pressed, it's toggling, right? Here, when both are pressed, the signal is toggled. Both are not pressed, it will keep the same state. But when both are pressed, the signal is toggling. Then there's another one, a simple one, D flip flop. It has only one input. All these can be created. Just uh, you can just go and study this. I will explain these things in detail in the next day before we begin the lesson, right? But before that, I would like you to explore this. Actually, D flip flop is also a uh, also a conversion of SR flip flop, right? But it has only one. So how? So one one thing that you can do is for an example, let's do something like this. Only one input, but just maintaining not gate there. Just having a not gate there. Then you can put that as. So this is an example, right? This is an example of how modifications can be done. So now when you press this, you can see uh, when you press this, this will be automatically the other signal. So just think about this. This is set. When you off, unset, set, reset, set. Reset. Now it is only one switch. It's very simple. When you press one, it will set. When you press zero, reset. One set, reset. But don't think just as a switch because switch cannot memorize. But this can memorize the state. That is the thing. When you set this, it is it is flow. It is it is like rotating and it's memorized. When you unset, so this is what basically is used in the designing. Used in design. These D flip flops are commonly used in memory design. SRAM design. Okay, just go through these things. I would like you to study these things and come back by next day. Then we can discuss more about the T flip flop and JK other things. I have just given an idea about the D flip flop. When you set, it will be set reset. When uh, it will be reset, that is D flip flop. Anyway, these are maintaining the status here. D is one. It is set. D is zero. It is reset. It's maintaining the status. So. With that, we conclude, we, are, we have done, we have finished the lesson.
but I need to uh, explain the in detail uh, things about the JK and T and D flip flops. I will do that next day, right? But anyway, in the, uh, in the examination, they will not expect in-depth answers for these things. If you know about these flip-flops, it can be one or two, there can be one or two questions in the paper, but don't think it is not difficult. It is about the memory circuits. Okay then, good night. See you all next week. Yes, sir.